Hi, this is Paul Terrow from Delium Advisory with another FMC for organizations, frameworks, models and concepts. So ways to think about your business, your not-for-profit, so that you can have and enjoy long-term success. In this session here, we want to cover off the balanced scorecard. It's a scorecard. It's a way of scoring the performance of your organization. You know, for some people, it's, it's just all about the performance. Uh, uh, the finance. Uh, so other people it's all about the, the customer and how well you're treating the customer. Whereas this framework, this balanced scorecard that has been around since the um, late 80s, early 90s, is a way of looking holistically at your organisation. So let's get into it. SFSL. S stands for systems. What are the systems that you have in place? Think about that production line system. How well is that performing? Think about your, your finance system, your HR system. Think about the system where information is moved around within the organisation. How well are those systems performing? And what are those systems? The second is uh, finance. How well uh, are you operating financially? Are you profitable? Is there much wastage? Are you getting a, uh, a satisfactory return from the investments that you have made? The third one here um, is your stakeholders. Yes, your stakeholders are those who uh, uh, perhaps own the, the, the capital, the owners of the business. They have a stake in how well the business is performing, the directors. Uh, what about the, the clients, your customers? They also have a, a stake in how well uh, your business is performing. And back to those customer service metrics, back to the level of engagement that you have with uh, both types, the all types of stakeholders. How do you measure the, um, uh, the performance that you have with respect to your stakeholders? And the final one is uh, learning and development. It is important and doubly so uh, in today's business environment. Uh, that there is a continual learning and development. How well are your staff uh, performing? Are they getting the opportunities to upskill and to improve uh, their capacities of work? Are they being challenged? What about the managers? What about the executives? What about the, the teams that you have, the teams of people? What about the training programs that you have in place? Uh, are, they going to, are people going to seminars? Are, are there things which are happening internally? Are people being given, like say Google and other organisations, being given that day off to perhaps uh, uh, improve some products, work on some skunk work type things? This learning and development. So there we have it. SFSL, Systems Finance, stakeholders and the final one learning and development the balanced scorecard a way of looking at your organization and uh, and finding out how well it is performing a, a holistic view on its performance this has been paul terro of delium advisory with another fmc for organizations thanks for listening